Okay, so I'm going to show you real quick how to take a bowl off of these uh, non-serviceable carburetors, these Chinese carburetors. And some Hondas and Yamahas actually do this on their smaller bikes. And they do this for emissions, I believe, for the California emissions crap. So what you're going to want to do um, is drill these down just like this. They're just brass, so they're super easy to drill. So sometimes when you're drilling them, they'll actually completely break off and, or what they'll do is they'll go through like that. As you can see, it went all the way through. That's no big deal. Um, you can see the head just came off of this one. And that one, there are still screw threads down there, which is good. I just got to back that piece out, which isn't too hard. Um, it's best to hit these with a center punch first to get it as centered as you can. So you're not messing up your screw threads. And then get yourself an extractor. If you don't have an extractor, you could just kind of take a, uh, flat or I mean a Phillips head and kind of hammer it on there just a little bit and then it should it should twist loose but um I'll show you real quick what I'm gonna do all right and then I'm gonna tap your extractor in there let's see if I can get this with pliers usually I use vice grips but you can see the way that the screw is actually unscrewing which is nice I'm surprised that I'm able to get this with no regular pliers but all it is is th these are literally just screws so you're not going to damage anything just as long as you don't damage the threads you'll be all right see just like that and you can get your bowl off um nice thing is you can just grab that and unscrew it with a pair of pliers and you should be able to should be able to unscrew this by hand now so if they if they the head breaks off or something like that that's fine because you can go in there like i said just like this and unscrew it just make sure you go and get yourself some replacement screws. So I have a whole kit here that I've actually made for myself a couple years back. And what these are, in case you need them, they're gonna be M470 by 16 or M470 by 12, um, whatever size you want. Um, just make sure you get the proper size or at least just match them up with the same length as the old ones because if you get too long of ones, they'll go through and just break the aluminum or strip it out. And uh, just pretty much simple as that.